what they don't know, the real name for this thing they call cyberspace is actually... Pandemonium! What is life without its body? What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of... I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live never cross that threshold, for their souls will join those ghostly ranks. You heard their voices? What did they say? They spoke not in the language of mortals, no. They howled, screaming in agony, forever removed from their earthly form. Among them was a woman, her voice of ice, Queen Lilith. She was calm, but at the cost of her humanity. You ask, who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? No one's asking. And I answer you, the techno-necromancers of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look.
President Myers is one of them. Why so many shootings? Why do countless die on the streets as the police do nothing? What human would condemn his brethren to such suffering? And why? And where did this filth slither out from, you ask? Antarctica, you said that already. Today they hide amidst the snow and ice of the South Pole. Step by step, usurping our crown as creation's chosen. Millions of years ago, they evolved from dinosaurs to become the world's first advanced, intelligent race. And who is their progenitor? Their masters? The scientists of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation? so that I may continue my mission. Nothing but lint in my pockets. Sorry. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold. I can be anything you want me to be. Ready yourself, for they are coming! Mm. Such skin and bones. Open your mind before it is too late! they've transformed into the fanged beasts. They set off on the hunt, hungry for human flesh. Dozens of miles they cover in the darkness, with ferocious speed, like arrows in the night! I don't know, it doesn't add up. If they can move like that, why all the trucks and bikes? Ah, ah, when the moon shines full, I said. Only three nights a month. During their orgies of blood, they devour all in the area. In the day, they must drive to virgin lands in search of new prey. And the cause behind these monstrous horrors? Years ago, a ship from Alpha Centauri crash-landed in the Badlands. 
Legend tells that it carried a substance highly sought after by the vampire elite in Arasaka. It could transform Saburo's enemies into werewolves, leashed and bound to his will. But the crash thwarted You got a problem with nomads, freak? Better shut your fat fucking mouth before I put you six feet under. You can break my bones, but you cannot stop the pursuit of truth. Howdy, fellas. How's life with the Alicaldos? Look who it is. V. It's all good. Pan Am's kicking off a new role. <laughs> Say, you know this nut job? A little. He's totally harmless. Says things that make a politician look like a beacon of truth. Were you aware Hanako Arasaka is a vampire? <laughs> the fuck? And here I was all offended. <laughs> yeah, gotta tell Saul, or, you know, eat somebody, then disappear like an arrow in the night. Have a good one, V. That was close. They're not as dangerous in the daylight, but it still could have ended badly. Thank you for your concern, though I could have done without the mockery. No problem. I mean, who's gonna tell me how we fake the Mars landing if I let him knock your teeth out? You have no faith in my words, do you? You think I don't know when I'm mocked? When they take me for a false prophet? It's hard to take your interpretation seriously, but there is a little truth in what you say. Sometimes even more than a little. You see it too! You know that behind a veil of darkness lurk creatures from our nightmares, but you fear to believe it! You know, if you had any kind of real evidence of this grand cosmic plot. I do! Tonight! They're meeting at an old factory in Kabuki to exchange something important. Observe them! Seize this item, this Alpha Centauri artifact. You'll see I was right from the beginning! Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. How do you even know about this meeting? Their radio waves resonate within my brain. Ever since the accident, I've heard their secret broadcasts. The accident. You know that doesn't instill confidence, right? You don't understand! I have their co-processor in my head! I don't know how my Ripper Doc got his hands on it. But thanks to this, I can listen into their plots and schemes. If you help me, we can save this planet together! Okay, I'll see what I can do. Thanks for the tip, I think. You mustn't intervene too soon, or too late. All could be lost. The fate of humanity rests upon your shoulders. Don't let us down. Do not let me down. No pressure, got it.
The time has come for a close encounter of the third kind. A small step for V, but a giant leap for humankind. Who are you betting on showing up? The reptilians or techno-necromancers? The Spanish Inquisition. I admit, I didn't expect that. Enough joking around. Gotta be quiet. Gotta wait. No one. As expected, I guess. Gotta be honest, though, I'm pretty disappointed. Don't lose hope yet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Someone actually showed. It's a maelstrom. Techno necromancers, then. I knew those reptilians were bullshit. I can't believe it. There's some actual conspiracy shit going down right now. What says the Wolf Father to the Moon Mother as she descends to Earth? I have protected the realm of man and shadow, but today they are protected by our children, whose name is Petrosite. of his failure, he became lost in the forest. Lilith has concealed the Tenth Circle from the Ancestor's eyes. <laughs> I was hoping for green blood. Life really is nothing but an endless disappointment. Wonder what our prophet will say about this chip.
think you are ready. Where's Gary? What happened? I warned him! Some black suits came by, blue eyes and all, looked just like he said. Then, then they threw him in an AV and, and flew him to the mothership! No one's tried to help? Not a soul. The police say he's sick. Truth of it is, he knows too much. He's a threat to him. Right now, I'm collecting donations for a monument in his honor to remember his courage and the crimes of Alpha Centauri. Care to spare a few eddies? In love and memory? Ah, why not? Gary's earned his grand fucking monument. Take this, before I change my mind. God, I don't know what to say. Gary'd be so touched. I got this chip here. You mind taking a look? <sighs> Gary did say you're devoted to our cause. I show me. I'll tell you what I know. Jesus Christ, hide that quick! Nobody can know, got it? Why, what is it? What's this all about? Gary knew this had happened! They here! To bend us to their will, to, to make us their puppets! Whoa, calm down. Who is? The Tecro Necromancers? And lo! They shall descend upon the earth unseen, the sky shrouded in darkness. That's what he said! Night's coming! The Eternal Night! And so ends the epic saga of discovering secrets of paranormal beings. What's this story taught us? The lack of closure sucks. I don't disagree, but I had something else in mind. Some people know more than others. They hear the private conversations of the world's elite. And what do they do with that knowledge? They invest all their time reinventing age-old fairy tales. Oh, where's your sense of imagination? I choose to believe we narrowly avoided war with vampires and aliens. Don't we all? Vampires, aliens, reptilians, all captivating. Romantic, even. Truth, on the other hand, is brutally mundane. Its corpse pulling the strings. Twisted bastards skezzed out on their power fantasies. Think that's what we saw? Shady corpo biz? No doubt about it. They're the world's real bloodsuckers. Them, and always them. 